days. I've pondered since the submissions and presentations yesterday uh, from uh, our learned friends appearing for the petitioners as to what really this evidence is. I have, in the course of struggling to look for this evidence, come across three possible areas we'll be talking about. In the affidavit of one John Mark Gidongo, they make reference to a form 34A from Baringo County TRT constituency. They then say that that is an example of a form that was intercepted. Michael Ouma, in his affidavit, confirms that in fact the form that was uploaded or that was attached in the affidavit of John Mark Gidongo is not a form that arose from the process that, uh, that, that they allude or allege it arose from. That according to him, this form was downloaded, somebody tried to interfere with the with the details on it and attached it to an affidavit. Now that, if you ask me, is perhaps the silliest way of doing any of these things because if somebody asked you whether that form was authentic, you only need to look at the public portal. You then need to verify it with the form 34A that was presented. My ladies and my lords, as a statutory requirement, we delivered all the form 34As to this court. We have a copy. The entire public has copies of each of each and every of those documents. Our team went through those documents. And in relation to that specific form 34A, to say the least, it's a forgery. 